Hello hello na karibu sana to my YouTube channel Manzeka moja subscribe please consider subscribing because a lot more is coming so manze niko hapa hivi Jomo Kenyatta International Airport mimi mkambo I have to say it in full juu nikisemaje ke any it a mess so tuko hapa hivi kwa shughuli moja if mungai if aliweza ku fly jana kwenda Mombasa uh, kumwendea sistake I'm talking about Shani, Shanira something siko si shona hiyo jina uh, because anakuja uh, Nairobi tu uh, kwa shughuli za kukushana na Eric Mondi na maybe we'll probably not sure about that so sasa hivi tunawategea pia wanakaa mkiangalia pale kuna some members of Kenya online media uh, tuko tu hapo hivi kwa shughuli ya kumngoja uh, a uh, Shanarina Afike akiwa uh, na Mungai Eve na mama na mama yake pia uh, ndio tuweze kupiga story tuelewe ni shughuli zipi maybe zimewaleta hapo uh, Nairobi maybe, maybe ni media to we don't know so we are waiting for them ndio wakifika uh, tuweze kupiga story na wao tuelewe uh, mambo fulani kisha tuweze kuendelea na kazi stay tuned manze uh, labda tuambie Mombasa ulienda lini na kukuja safari imekuwa vipi na ni shughuli gani zilikupeleka Mombasa maybe Ai Mombasa nilina juzi juzi usiku na nimerudi leo asubuhi kwa sababu head head naongea no, pale pale and then I shout you're joking <laughs> so nilienda juzi the reason nilikuwa nimeenda kwa sababu mdogo wangu alikuwa anakuja so nikaona ni vizuri pengine niende niende nikuje naye pia nilikuwa na shughuli kidogo nilikuwa naenda enda kufanya kule yeah. the last time tuliona uliona Mombasa ulikuwa umepelekea ilikuwa mondish vitu fulani tu pale because tuliona kwa video yako na presentali mm -hmm. after this time Mombasa ilikuwaaje ilikuwa poa i can't complain but always mombasa kuna joto kweli mimi sipendi joto <laughs> is it your first time kuingia to go there yeah it's my first time and the experience is well mimi na gopa heights sana eh hapana sikutapika mtu alitapika ni obuya so it time when you go in now mombasa mwana nani mtu ame anashikilia pale Ati naye alikuwa ameshikilia pale kwenye channel. Kwenye channel alikuwa nimeacha videos, nilikuwa nimefanya videos kibao juzi. Oh, okay. yeah. Kama zile zime releaseiwa jana umezishoot kitabu. Exactly. Okay. And naona umekuja na eh wasi jana wawili kama nitasema mmoja asiye mmoja. Nina mama na msichana. Ah, wewe unaitwa Shanaria, Shanaria Evans. I'm very sure some of you probably umemwona kwenye channel yangu. She's my little sister. Okay. Then uh, here is the mom. That's the mom. Mm. Anaitwa nani pia? Atuambie. Ah, uh, naitwa Zil, Zilpa. Mimi ni mama Keshanaria. Na Eve is like my first born daughter. Tunampenda sana, ame yes. support, tuna appreciate juzi alitukujia. Mhm. Mm kwa spend night time Mombasa said ko tukafika na Nairobi we are happy to be in her presence yeah last yeah. time nimeona mi mwenyewe nimeona shanaria nimeona kwenye ile ordinary challenge mm -hmm. uh, shughuli zake pengine za muziki zimefikia yeah she did the ordinary challenge though of course cause of her age mm -hmm. akukua liable to fanya but just for the finally fanya but uh, alikuwa she was working on her music mm -hmm. na leo ame release her own single video it's called knees and toes okay. it's really amazing mm -hmm. iko pale youtube it's an piano version mnafa oh. kuingia msubscribe muone mumsupport yeah. mtoto mm. yeah yeah pengine if is that one of the reasons why umemkujia pia Ah uh, yeah it's one of the reasons na pia nili feel like uh, I think kuna jua Mombasa kidogo inakuwa nga kidogo tu iko nyuma but ukiwa hapa Nairobi inakuwa ni rahisi sana unaweza access media watu wataweza kujua uko na nyimbo mpya na pia alikuwa anatamani sana kupata na lyrics sije mbona anatamani so uh, probably leo atakuwa akipatana <laughs> yeah tena kwa shughuli gani Alikuwa tu anatamani anatamani kupata na Eric na Willy Paul. I think ni ile tu kwa mdogo uko na wale masta unatamani kupatana na wao. Tumeona Eric Mwende ki support eh wasanii kadhaa na most of the people ambao wao wanakuwa featured kwenye the channel zen. Tumeona mem support Manzo Kibera at some point. Tumeona mem support watu kadhaa tu. I just want to know amesema kama kama pingine atakuwa na support Shanaria in any way. Uh, no uh, talking of the support we haven't talked about that cuz uh, exactly what you wanted ni kupatana naye alikuwa tu anataka apatane naye so maybe from there tunaweza tuka tunaweza tukajua unajua pia uwezi ukapangia mtu mimi sipendi hii tabia unajua sana sana sikuizi especially nowadays kuna hii tabia yenye wasanii tutapangia hao wasanii wakubwa lazima nifanyie hivi i don't think it's a right way so she's just going to meet the artist yeah, yeah. na pengine shanaria if you meet Eric Mondi what are you going to tell him I'm going to tell him 
<laughs> oh, she's just very excited to meet him. <laughs> what are you going to tell him? Tell me what you want to know. Yeah, uh, uh, tukitoka tu mbali kidogo kando kidogo na history ya Shanari lakini tutakuwa tunarudi baadaye mm-hmm. what we you know is that right now eh, wife material season 3 inaendelea yeah. ebu tupe udaku kadhaa kuhusu wife material because i know we ni mtu wa karibu na recommend <laughs> eh unataka udaku side gani niambieni eh, unataka kujua wina ama unataka kujua aje kama sasa hivi Eric ame fall in love na binti yuko pale kwenye wife material Ah mimi nikiangalia kwenye video kuna hiyo binti sijui kama ni mimi pekee naona ama ni nani ama pia nyinyi mnaona mnajua huyu binti ametoka ametoka Ethiopia anaitwa Tracy that lady eh nimekuwa nikiona hapa wako wako karibu sana comparing with other ladies but today we are going to meet Eric in the evening probably atatuambia pengine ashamchagua ama ni kipindi tu i don't know alafu pia kuna yule flozi fire baby ah fire baby alipele kwa Kempinski Ah, uh, unajua finals bado. So probably pingine bado ataingia pale, but I was very excited kuona at least walipatana because alikuwa anatamani sana kupatana na Eric. Eh, hey, anajua wengi wetu hata hatujai kufika Kempinski for a dinner. Tuna maswali mengi watu wamejiuliza hapo kwa hiyo Eric sorry. But Eric amekulipa ndio maana unafanya bidii zake sana back to back. Ah, Eric mwenyewe ataweza no, kunilipa kweli. Ah, <laughs> 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 uh, okay, Eric is my good friend. Ah, uh, we have more of you are close. Sisi ni mabeshte sana sana. And um kufanya video zake it's more of supporting each other. Unajua nikienda nifanye content yake pia mimi kuna venye ninajenga. Ana ninapata content na pia yeye kinyana nataka ijulikane hapa nje inajulikana yeah so hakuna kulipwa how is it working na yeye na yeye ni star of course anajiita the president of comedy hapa ni africa mzima i'm also the president of content <laughs> uh, how is it working with him it's very nice cuz eric eric ni mse by the way working with eric especially if you are a girl Eric anajua kutreat wasichana vizuri by the way. Haizi kutreat vibaya. Na by the way guy msini miss. Msini ya love you. Msini ya love vingine. Okay, comparing with other other maybe celebrities that I've met, Eric anajua kutreat wasichana vizuri sana. Haizi kutreat vibaya. He always make sure uko poa, ume umefika home vizuri. Yaani kila kitu iko sawa. I can't complain working with him. I'm sure pia Kioko. Kioko, mbona ah, anataka kumwaga mtama? <laughs> um, okay. Yes. Uh, lakini nimeona pia wewe ni your close friend Willy Paul. Yeah, he's my good friend. Yes. Mbona ume ume postpone the uh, album? Guy, why are you are you asking hard questions? <laughs> Your He's my friend. Yeah. Uh, we talked actually yesterday and there are some there are some things zenye hazijakamilika. Kuna collaborations zingine amefanya huko nje na kidogo hazi hawakuwa hako amemalizana na hizo management zingine. So that's why kuna that delay but the album is going to drop very soon. Actually probably maybe in a week's time. Watu wanasema huko kwa sani yewezi. Anasema haiwezi. Eh, tuambie wewe unaonaje? Unaonaje? Ah, unajua kama mtu anasikia haiwezi pia atoe yake tu na kama itaweza. Na ni waogopa wasanii. Mwangai. Mbona ni waogope ni binadamu wa kawaida? Mimi I think uh, principles za msee ndio wazi na mata. If you principal hakuna kitu utafanywa na mse juu hakuna mtu atakufanya kitu by force okay. so uh, i don't think so na pia unajua msani kama Willie Paul ni msani mwenye probably kuna mafans wake wanapenda akimba love songs akimba love songs anasikia zimeweza mm-hmm. akienda vingine tena na imba hizi zingine maybe mtu ana feel azijaweza mm-hmm. but mafans ndio wanaweza wakaamua unajua mimi siwezi nikasimama hapa nisemaye haijaweza ama imeweza mimi sijui Uh, what I say is uh, you're not supposed to mix business with friendship you know uh, muziki ni biashara na mimi na yeye we are close friends yes so siwezi nikafika pale na zati sasa nataka kuwa fix just because we are friends kama mziki wake na na wa Willie Paul pengine utaingiana they can always work on something yeah okay ningependa kuuliza swali tatu kwanza ni kwamba ni nao wasanii wanaweza kufungua ndoto zao vile vile mnamo anaweza ku launch ndoto leo so maybe ndio kujua pia wewe una mpango ya ku launch hivi ngai level ama record level swali ya kwanza ya pili ndio kujua sana msanii wako ama sister yako ana umri wa miaka ngapi 
na vile vile ni kama umemshikanisha na Eric kuna nia ama kuna njia ambayo tunaweza ona Eric anaweza ku na ye, kufanya content uh, ama muziki ya, ya, ya wife material ama vile Eric anaweza kumsign ama anaweza kumsaidia kimuziki kile Ah oh, okay umia etsalia kwanza umuliza Heather I have a plan of coming up with a record label a record label to be honest aki na siko baya mimi mambo ya muziki kidogo hapana I wouldn't love to come up with a record label the reason being kwa sababu eh hey, mimi naonanga muziki needs a lot of needs a lot of attention na pia content creation pia ina need a lot of attention so i feel like uh, nikianza ku divert attention inaweza kuwa ngumu sana kwa upande wangu but wacha tuache wenye wanaweza wasukumane na muziki for a record label uh, no i want to hapa kwa msanii wetu ukikutana mm-hmm. recommend utamwambia nini angalia uko mbele mm-hmm. ukikutana na recommend utamwambia nini mm-hmm. So just talk like normal. Mhm. Talk like normal. Ni kwanza ujatuambie umri wake ni ngapi? Alafu ya tatu ni kwamba ni Eliko Mundi, yeye kupata na Eliko Mundi. Kuna uhusiano wako nao wa kibiashara, anaweza kuwa amepatiwa kazi maybe ya kutengeneza a theme song ama a, a, a song a jingle for the wife material tree. Mm-hmm. Ama Eliko Mundi atamchukua msaini aweze kumsaidia kama wale madem wale wazao saidia awali. Mhm. Okay. Shan, tell them how old are you? I'm 9 years old. Yeah, she's 9. She's 9 years. Yeah, 9 years old. And uh so lingine umuliza kama kupata na na Eric uh kuna husu biashara. For now it's not business. It's it's just casual. Amekuwa kiniona na Eric sana. So pia anatamani. Unajua ukiwa na sister pia unataka kukuwa kama yeye. Yeah, so for now hakuna mambo ya biashara. Okay. Do you feel it's right for her to go public because na elewa umri yake ni ndogo sana na anahitaji kufocus na muziki. Mhm. Wenda anaweza kupotea njia aka ustai kama ingia kidogo akasoma mambo ya masomo ama anaweza kushinda ku balance masomo na maisha yake kawaida. Okay, I feel like with the right parenting haizi akashindwa aka ku balance because the mom is always there and I make sure pia yeye anaenda shule, anafanya kazi zake vizuri. Kama leo today is on a Friday, na normally Fridays kwa shule yao kuna anga classes. So that's why yako hapa. Hajawahi hata sh- shule atiji anaenda, anaenda kufanya muziki. So I feel like uh, it's a matter of balancing in a good parenthood. Wazazi wakiweza kum, kumonyesha the right way itakuwa sawa. So if swali ya mwisho hapa, mm-hmm. uh, umesema eti haupendi yani love yako kwa music haiko kabisa na tunajua I'm not saying that I don't have love for music I've said okay I love music yes, yes. but I wouldn't want to have a le- uh, record label reason being eh hey, wasani wasani it's not hard lakini, it's not easy let me let me finish mm. lakini tunajua mpenzi wako alikuwa msanii mhm alikuwa msanii wa gospel mhm labda um, wakati unasema hivyo yeye yeah, haimuaffect Sasa kama ina mwafeti na wewe. Sasa mwafeti vipi? Kwani anataja ni msign? Aya aiwezi kama affect cuz nowadays he, do, he, he don't do music. But I feel like he's in the best position to answer that. Aka hapa tetibu. Atambie, atambie. Album inaanguka lini? Ngoja ngoja. Album ya Pose. So mngoje niko kwa album ya Pose. Aka featured. Niko featured mngoje. Next week. So pose ni wewe anaongojea saa hii ndo ndo Hapana, ni msanii fulani mkali sana, sitaki okay. kusema but next week. <laughs> na kwa nini ulipose kwa kwa usanii kwa sababu hujakuwa ukiimba kwa muda sasa. Ah, ah yeye hata mjue hiyo ili, usanii. Nilichoka. Ah. Yeah. Eh, I'd like to ask you about uh, how is it working with your husband? Mm. Uh, Working with him is my director it's very interesting because I, f- I think he's the only person who is able to ad- understand me but then mimi I'm um, I think I'm very hard to work with by the way in <laughs> I'm the kind of girl mwenye anapenda ku stick ku stick na ku stick na chenye yeye ana feel it right but tukiunganisha ideas pamoja huo na find that naweza nikaenda na idea yake so it's very it's very amazing but I kukosi challenges by the way kuna challenges yeah So, so yeah. okay. So how? Sorry. Sorry. Well, mm? how, how many days? How many days is she staying here? How many days are you going to stay here? Uh, she's only here for two days. Leo na kesho Saturday. Because Sunday arudi nyumbani because Monday is school. Yes. Ah, atujajua mama yake anaitwa nani? 
Alisema ni shazio. Ni shazio. Yes. Kweli mrembo sana. Ah! Hivi kiliruhusu nikuuliza hii swali. Unaona nyumba yako ni tahari kila kitu kwa nyumba. Una mtu wako wa karibu sana kipenzi chako. Director Trevor ameonesha mapenzi ya dhati. Nataka kujua sisi kama online in-laws eh harusi itakuwa lini na maybe ndoa itaweza kukamilisha familia. Ah, oh, ni swali. Okay. <laughs> ah, harusi, mlolaza harusi. Ah, uh, I feel like um it's still early to talk about a wedding. I'm just 21 by the way. Me seems there by the way. I feel like it's still young. I still have a lot I, I need to accomplish right now. Na jo wedding pia ni gharama. Na pia nataka ni kuwe na mabishi wenye watanletea zawadi. So wateni kwanza tuomoke. Gharama na na marafiki wote wale zawadi. Mimi naweza kutoleza budget yako ifanayo in mind maybe for for your for your wedding kama siling ngapi? Milioni ngapi? Ah, to be honest, I've never like budgeted for it, but I am very sure I would love a very fancy wedding. Yani wedding ya kifahari. Kuna wedding ya kifahari? Sijui yeah. kuna. Eh. Yeah. Ah, uh, so lingine ya mwisho tumalize sasa. Ah, uh, watu wanauliza ununua ile nyumba pesa ngapi? Ah, nilinunua pesa ngapi? Yeah. Unajua sasa hata nikiwaambia nilinunua pesa ngapi, mtu anaweza aenda akanunua pata ni bei tofauti. Kwa hivyo it differs unless maybe mtu anataka kununua by the way anaweza ni reach out anaweza nikamwelezea venye nilipata labda unaweza ina range ina range wewe majoka unatafuta title tumalize <laughs>